prospecting partner is over there looking for some mineral. I am over here in this small zone of oxidized schistos rock and finding some uh, pretty cool samples here. So you have what looks like pyrite, a little bit of chlorotized schists, some quartz in there, maybe some hematite. Here's another grab sample. And here's another sample with oxidized quartz. And you can see you have iron sulfides. Big chunks of iron pyrite in there. So we're gonna poke around a bit, hammer some of these float rocks here, see if we can find any exposure. Samples here with magnetite, hematite, and this looks like uh, quartz interwoven. And if you take a look over here. I just pulled this hunk of vein right off this edge right here, broke it open, and you have some nice sulfides with a little bit of quartz carbonate in there, pyrite as your primary sulfide. This is the other half right here. So I think we found ourselves a small little showing. Lots of uh, overburden and stuff all over top. We'll see if we can't find another decent sample. Look at that. More grab samples all over the place. Just loaded with sulfides. Mineralized quartz. So looking like we got some sort of showing here. We just got to properly uncover it. So we got our samples here. Mineralized quartz. Lots of schists. It looks like there's two veins. One's got uh, mainly coarse grain pyrite with uh, some magnetite hematite. The other one is solid masses, which are following your foliations and your schists, as well as quartz veining like this calcopyrite, pyrite. Those are our samples. We're gonna post the assay result for um, two of these, this sample and this sample. So stay tuned for that.